there, boy. Whoa there, brother. Don't go off that one. All right. Well, I'm going slow. Let me open these guys up. Make sure that's the right one. That is not. Oh, there's my map in my pocket. God. I was saying earlier, I need to carry a map in my pocket. And there it is. There we go. All right. Yeah, I got that thing on that side. All right. <laughs> ah, I can feel some air coming in. Nice. I feel much air coming in. Yeah, see, we're going to be a dark. Welcome to the uh, second edition of Twilight Widget. Once again, I bring you the night rides of the rich and famous. So. Yeah, because I got to hit Crown King. And then that's pretty easy getting down. I, I mean, it's, this is easy, but if I'm in the dark, I won't feel so lost. I'm lost. It's well marked. How about that? Man, I'm just all about this night riding shit. Oh, it's up there in the clouds still. Okay, cool. I thought I had to gun down behind the, uh, behind the mountain. So we'll take the one that runs us to Bumblebee, not Baletti Bay Sun. And that's the shortest of the two routes. Yeah, like I said, it sucks because I want to sit down, but I'm a goopy mess. It sticks to my upper legs. It doesn't allow a seating position. And I don't know enough about these adventure pants. I don't know if that's normal. I'll ask my friend. Adventure man. Hear that? Uh huh. Traction, traction. Nice soft kinda. So, one thing I didn't do was put rim locks in. I really should have. Like I said, I think I got 25 in the front, 23 in the back for the road. Yellow bikes down there. I do see a pickup bed. Just looking out there, making sure the. Let's take a minute here. Yeah, the sun is still up in the clouds. Good. Okay. Miles we got. Uh, 31, excellent. So I would say gotta be within eight eight miles. Wouldn't you think? Leave a comment down below. So, saw that nap flying around my helmet. Oh sorry, sorry for the sniffles, forgot. I was going to take a Claritin today, but I didn't. I'm kind of paying the price for it. Because all it looks beautiful, I know it looks beautiful with the green and the flowers, but those are actually weeds and pollen. So. <laughs> I'm watching you, son. I'm watching you. Take your time, brother. Take your time. I'm sweating in this thing. 
I'm just not moving a lot of air through there. There we go. There's the sun coming out. So it's got a little bit more to go before it goes below the mountains there. We will just keep pressing. Woo, okay. That was kind of a loose situation here. I mean, cool road, don't get me wrong. Whoops. I missed this gear twice. Someday I'll move that shifter. I'm sticking to that story. Someday I'll come back, take in all the sights, have my cup holder, my coffee, maybe a egg McBuffin on my uh, tank bag. But tonight, we're going. There was a poem, I think it's Robert Frost. It's like my, my little pony or something like that. Anyway, the one thing I remember out of that is the woods are lovely dark and deep. But I have promises to keep and miles to go before I sleep. And I don't remember the whole thing, but I learned that when I was in sixth grade, seventh grade, seventh grade. Had to do that line for a play. One academy, of course, but all right, which way are we gonna go? We're gonna go slowly. Now this part, I'm kind of recognizing, because I've been down here a little ways, and I turned back from Crown King. I just went home the rest of the way. So if I'm right, we should be coming into some buildings. We'll cross a creek or a bridge or a bridge over a creek. We'll hit Crown King. We'll be off the Senator Highway and running down the hill for a bumblebee. It's going to hop another the lane, but the rut's a little too big. Let's do it anyway. There we go. Use that for a burn. Maybe not. Sure looks familiar. I know I've been up to Crown King before and I kind of came out a little ways on the highway. And then I go, eh, I don't want to do this. It's too late in the day. Of course, you know, when does that stop me? The Twilight Widget. Outside. So back to the inside. I know I'm talking, but it's sure better than me singing or whistling. Alright. Go down here. Ooh, come on, baby, slow it down. There we go. A little chatter from the rear end. And excellent. The yard's earning its keep tonight. It wanted to get out. I'm sure it's happy. Man, this water crossing central. Okay. 
but they live in the desert. Whoa, look at that bear. Holy shit. I have never seen a bear in the wild before. Fuck me, all right. That was a big old cinnamon colored black bear. And he was good size. Holy shit. I'm glad he was running. I do have my 40, but I would rather just mosey on by him. So. <laughs> oh, fuck. Shit. Wouldn't that suck to see him and crash and then hear his dinner tonight? He probably thought that was dinner and he saw the bike and he goes, Ah, oh, DR. What are the chances of me catching that? I know it's not going to break down. Man, that was some scary shit, I tell you. I have never seen a uh, bear in the wild. And that was a good size one. Hopefully the camera's still going. I put a new card in it. Never know. Damn, that thing was huge. I can't believe how big it was. I'll get home and it's probably about the size of a Dover or something. But they look big to me. Welcome to Bearzona. Right. I have been to Bearzona, but that's not really wild. Since you park your cars in, drive right through them. It's a bear park. Well, I guess I have never been down this road. I was wrong. It sure looked familiar though. It looked like that one other area I was on. They tell you I saw a bear? God dang. Thing was 30 feet. Oh shit me. Okay. 30 feet tall. It was like Bearzilla. Which is Godzilla over there. Wow. Who would have thunk? I'm glad with that being my only bear I ever see. Man, still freaks me out. I just want to get the Crown King while the daylight's still here. Not really sure how much farther. And sure of the road I'm on. I can always tell like the next day, like tomorrow. I don't realize how hard I was working this bike until I go to wake up and I go, oh, why is my arms, my shoulders this way? Because, my dear, it's 350 pounds. That was something. I might just make a short video of, I saw a bear. Huh. Well, I'll cross that off the bucket list too. Came up the back way to Prescott and uh, did the old center highway. Oh, shit. I hate this thing with the signs. Whole swarm of gnats. Okay. Horse Mountain Trail. I have no intention of doing that. I'm thinking it's to my left. I'll tell you what, because there's the antennas. You guys, keep an eye out for bears, all right? barely believe it. Uh, map. We 
Waste a minute, boy. Waste a minute. I moved over to... <laughs> to where, boy? Where? Okay. Crown King. I'm very close. So I'm going to keep going this way. I think the other road will be the long way. So. Alright, cool. That was funny. It looks like it went all the way over. Oh, road 52, right in front of me. Alright. So folks, since all the signs are all screwed up, you're for service money, hard at work, Stay on road 52 because I can't keep a sign going. 